good. How are you? Good. Good to see you on stage again. You, Killing it. With, like, how was it to work with Keon, who's a ballet dancer? How did you manage to have that, you know, complicity yeah. together on stage? I would totally be a liar if I didn't say it was tough. It was it was really tough. Um, and I knew it was going to be, and it wasn't like, I mean, you know, if, if maybe he was getting grimier and like really moving, maybe, maybe it would have been easier, but the style, it was like slow. Uh, and for somebody that is so upright, we worked and worked and worked and we never sat down. So I, and t for performance wise, he's not a known performer too. So I really wanted that to be what came out and I think it did, so. But yes, that was awesome. And it's usually harder on the choreographer who has to pass on his style. And you know, working with Dave, you worked with Dave before. Yeah, so yeah. it was, how do you think Dave managed to put his style into piano like that? Well, Honestly, the first day that Dave came in, I go, you are a genius. Like, he came in so prepared. He had the whole dance done, which I know isn't really Dave's style. I think he likes to go in and freestyle, but having someone like him, you know, a ballet dancer, it was really good that he came prepared. And also, he made it so he was leaning on me, and therefore, I was in front a lot, and I think could mask a little bit of the groove. So he just came in, I go, wow, Dave, like, you're smart. And what's fun is that he seemed to have so much fun with you and got relaxed a little bit. So you think it was maybe a chemistry between you guys that helped him get there? I mean, I, I tried and tried and tried to pull it out of him, and, and he did. And, and he would he would go resort back to what he usually does, which is ballet, and it's very mm -hmm. upright. And then we would watch a film, and I go, why'd you go backwards? And you got to keep going forwards. And then um, we had a really great rehearsal early this morning and a really bad dress run. He went backwards, and I go, it's yours to lose right now. Like, it really is yours to lose. And I just got chills because he won. In the end of the day, he wanted it so bad. And I go, just do it. You're going to regret it if you don't do it. So I, I'm so excited to see him perform because I know America hasn't seen that yet. And do you think it kind of saved him, even though they took everything in consideration to know who was going to stay today? Do you think it kind of saved him to have yeah. finally help him loosen up a little bit and have a little bit raw energy coming yeah. out of him that was like stuck in a box? Yeah, well, I always kind of feel like I get, as an all-star, get put with contestants that are outside of their element. Uh, I think the producers know me and I don't stop and I really, really try to pull everything out that I can. Um, so I knew that he could either walk to the judges and have the judges say, wow, you did a new style we've never seen you do hip hop, or he can walk there and they're going to say that and say, oh my God, you performed. And that's what I wanted, and I knew that that would be the saving ticket. And so, I'm I'm really happy for him. Well, that's awesome. Well, thank you so thank much, Lauren. Good to so see, good to see you. you. Always. She's amazing. She's amazing. Oh my God, this one.